All this month, get any smartphone 32 gig and under for 50% off regular price at Appalachian Wireless. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While supplies last, two-year agreement required. While a statewide burn ban is in effect, the David Area Volunteer Fire Department has had to put out nine forest fires since Friday. However, officials believe the fires have not started due to an everyday woodland or brush fire, but arsonists. We're down here investigating uh, these recent fires, I think, from over the weekend. So we're trying to figure out uh, who did it, and uh, uh, it seems like there were several fires set. And we, we do have some persons of interest at this time. While en route to several fires, officials at the fire department kept passing the same red vehicle, which seemed a bit unusual. However, it became even more unusual when neighbors began noticing and capturing that same vehicle on security cameras within minutes of the start of the fire. It puts other lives in danger, animals, livestock, people's property. Uh, there's a major gas line where that fire was initially set. You know, So, I mean, there's a lot of other dangers out there you don't see. Fire officials say they believe the arsonists began setting fires last November and are now continuing since the ground is good and dry. Anytime we get uh, some dry conditions, which we've had over the weekend, these arsonists will come out and they'll, they'll basically drive around and set these fires. And uh, from what I'm gathering so far, this is in a, in a kind of a loop area, so they've obviously uh, run around in a loop and, and just basically set fires. The Kentucky Division of Forestry has a $1,000 reward set for anyone that can help lead to a conviction of whoever is starting the fires. If you have any information regarding suspicious forest fires, contact the Kentucky State Police Post 9 in Pikeville or Post 13 in Hazard, the Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife, or the Kentucky Division of Forestry. Reporting in David for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.